It's going for scrap now, is it? <laughs> <laughs> What's the second-hand value? <laughs> Right, that's a bit of a Doctor Who, which you can see tonight. The team are here. We're going to pick up the telephones and take some calls. I think there should be one each behind you. As you there are indeed. Thank you. And we should have Natalie Taylor on the line. Hello, Natalie. Hello. Hello, you're through to the Doctor Who team. Can I talk to Colin Baker, please? Of course you can. Hello, Natalie. Hello. Were, were you always a Doctor Who fan? And if so, who was your favourite villain? Uh, yes, I always was a Doctor Who fan. I watched the very first episodes with William Hartnell and all the Patrick Troughton ones. And it was only when I started to work in the theatre business myself that I found that on Saturday evenings I was working and therefore missed some. Uh, and I've always watched it whenever I can. My favourite villain from the past, it has to be the Daleks, because I, like you, I hid behind the sofa when they came on. OK, right, Lee Anderson on the line. Hello, Lee. Hello. Hello, you through to the Doctor Who team. Can I speak to Colin, please? Hello, I'm here, Lee. Is it true that you're going to have a robot cat? Is it true I'm going to have a robot cat? Not as far as I know. No, I don't think that's true at all. It was, uh, it was a distortion uh, of the uh, fact that I wear a cat badge on my lapel. But there isn't going to be a robot cat that I know about. Right, thank you. Can I have the autograph, please? You can indeed. Right. Bye, -bye. Bye. Bye. Bye, bye. Right, and uh, we have Smith Harper. Is that right? Yes. Smith Harper. It's a funny, funny first name to have, Smith, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. All right then. Right, you're, you're through to Doctor Who, which is also a funny first name. Can you speak to Colin, please? Hello, Smith. Uh, I'd like to ask you, how many weeks in advance do you, ha do you have to have the Doctor Who series recorded? How long in advance? Well, we started the series that you'll be watching uh, starting tonight. We started that last May, and we've been working on it all the way through, and we're still working on the same series. And we, we will finish beginning of February, and you'll finish seeing them round about the middle towards the end of March. So it's about nine months ahead we start work on it. So you all start work that early, do you? Yes. A whole lot of you? Yes. Well, on, on the first story. What do you like working with as a doctor? Oh, wonderful. Is he? Yes. Is he fun to work with? Oh, yes. Just that's that. That's a nice that. <laughs> <laughs> OK, I'll give you a little shout-out. All right. Thank you, Colin. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Could you go just to my girlfriend, Emma Duncan, please? You sure you don't mind? Oh, yeah. No, I'm not. Uh, OK, well... Uh, I don't mind. Just what's, what's her name, Ella? Me? Ella? Did you say? Blow a kiss to her. I'll blow a kiss to her. There you are. Especially for you. An intergalactic smacker. <laughs> All right? All right. Thank you. Bye-bye, right. Smith. Bye. And here comes Ian O'Brien. Ian. Oh, can I speak to Colin, please? Yes, don't you want to talk to the ladies? They're sitting here, <laughs> just desperate for somebody to talk to. What did you think of the convention in October? What did I think of the convention in October? Uh, that was the convention in London, the Doctor Who convention. Yeah. Well, it's, it's the first one I've been to in this country, and I enjoyed it enormously. Unfortunately, I was only there for a couple of hours, but uh, all the people I met, I enjoyed meeting, and uh, we, we had a great afternoon. They have them all over the place, don't they, conventions? Yes, they do. Because I know you, didn't you two both go to a convention in the States? That's right, Earlier did, in yeah. the year? Was that yeah. good fun? Was that the same as the British ones? Similar. Yeah. They're very similar. Um, there's, there's a different sort of fan following in the two countries, which is too lengthy to go into now. But they're all, I mean, because they like the programme, they're always very nice, which, right. is, uh, okay. which is a joy to go and take part Smashing. In. OK, thanks for your call. Oh, can I have Colin's autograph, please? All right. Yes, you can. He's got a hand And up. Colin, could you say hello to my mum, please? Hello, his mum. <laughs> all right. Thank you. Thanks, Ian. And she said she's glad you got her, your hair cut. Oh, oh, really? That, eh? When didn't she like it? <laughs> Since you started. Oh, well, it's not really cut. Look at it. Right it's a now. mess. All right, thanks, you call. Bye. <laughs> right, we should have some more calls in a moment. We've brought a bargain with you, haven't you? Or you have a bargain? Yes, we have... Uh, which is hiding down here. A whole pile of bargains. There is a wonderful poster of the pantomime at Southampton running Sorry. for another week. Um, and I promised I'd mention the stage staff of the theatre, but I'm not going to. All right. Right. Uh, here also, we have a, a Dalek. Now, this is a new <coughs> Doctor Who product. Yes. It's a build, make yourself and paint yourself Dalek. Picture of uh, close to metal, that, isn't it? That's the best place for it, isn't it? Right. Another die cast metal, Cyberman. Great. Um, a picture of a very close friend of mine, which in encloses a record. From Australia. Doctor Who book, Keith Time. And a picture done by a, a wonderful American artist called Gail Bennett. Oh, lovely. Of myself on an intergalactic cat. There we are. It's a super picture. Which won't be coming into the series. It won't be coming into the series, no. <laughs> no, it won't. Smashing. So, super bargain. Yeah, Lovely, and you've got a question. The question is, what are Cybermen allergic to? 
What are Cybermen allergic to? Or put more grammatically, to what are Cybermen allergic? To what are Cybermen allergic? <laughs> Answers on a postcard to Saturday Superstore, BBC Television, London, W12, 8QT. To what are Cybermen allergic? Saturday Superstore, BBC Television, London, W12, 8QT. Good luck with that. You could win all these. Have your very own Dalek to ruin the carpet with.